What's up, members of the Barrio? It's John, coming to you from Greenwich Village, and pizza is one of the most famous food items you can get in New York City. But as many of you are aware, pizza originated in Italy, and I've always been curious, what do Italians think of New York-style pizza? Well, today, we're gonna answer that question as I have a good friend of mine, Gianni, a fellow travel vlogger, who is visiting from Italy, and get this, He's never tried New York City pizza. So we're gonna visit three famous places in the village and we're gonna see exactly what an Italian thinks of New York City pizza. It's three days that you, John, told me not to try the pizza and I'm really, really excited about this. So, where do we go? I have been starving Gianni of pizza. I said, hold it for this video. We're gonna be starting at Percy's, my favorite $1 slice in New York. We're gonna be trying all different types of New York City pizza. So dollar pizza, here we go. All right, you're about to take your first bite of a dollar New York pizza. Does dollar pizza exist in Italy? It exists, we call it the pizza alla taglio. And uh, yeah, usually you can find it for one euro, sometimes two euro. But yeah, we can find it. We can do it. Though. So it's this is a uh, foldable. <laughs> it's really New York style, huh? So let's let's try. Okay. I would say it's uh, it's good, huh? but not that good it's uh there is a lot of tomato taste i don't taste cheese at all the sour of the tomato uh the sour taste of the tomato so i don't taste so much the cheese i like that it's crispy yeah you can see i would say i will have some uh, oregano to give us some uh, herbs aromatic herbs taste and uh, I always put a little bit of a chili because I like my pizza hot and uh, let's see how it is now a bit better yeah I like the oregano on it. You know, this is my go-to dollar slice, especially like this late night. They're open until like four o'clock in the morning. What I love best about this pizza is it's got the extra crunchiness, crispiness when you bite into it. So I'm a big fan of the crust. Like Gianni said, I do think it tastes better you know, putting some oregano on it, but for me, I'm a traditionalist, just give me a dollar cheese slice, and I'm happy. Stop number two, we are in front of Joe's Pizza. This has gotta be one of the most popular slice joints in the entire city. I'll be honest, don't hate me, but I think they're a little bit overrated. They're not bad, but I wanted to take Gianni here just to get his opinion on a classic New York slice. Gianni, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm just curious to try it. This place, without fail, always has a long line. Super, super popular. Johnny, have you ever eaten a pizza this big in your life? Well, even bigger, actually. <laughs> but uh, if uh, we are talking about slices, it's quite... Uh, a large slice. I think for three dollars, I think it's a it's a good deal. All right, you're about to have one of New York City's most famous slices. Are you ready? Okay, I'm ready. Go get so it. I can see that it's uh, quite uh, full of cheese. This one, and uh, I like always to see how it's uh, below. And uh, yeah, it's cooked well. A bit a bit burnt, but not so much. So. Let's try to fold this one. Here we go, that che quite... the cheese is just falling off. Yeah. 
Mm. Okay. It's good. It's better than the other one. It's more juicy. And uh, it's not like the other one. It was just like kind of tomato. Here I can taste the cheese. Even if I wouldn't say that it's uh, so, so tasty, this cheese. I mean, it's okay. Like one of the most popular places ever. Mm, I will eat another slice of this. I mean, it's okay. We're moving on up. We are moving on up the pizza food chain here. So guys, this is just a huge slice. This is a traditional New York pizza. Three bucks from Joe's. You really can't go wrong. I mean, the only thing is it's so cheesy. It's falling apart on me. I gotta go quick. While difficult to eat because of all the cheese, it is very tasty. Again, I think it might be a little overrated at times, but I'll eat this. I mean, I, I think this is a very solid $3 slice. It's tough to go wrong at Joe's. They're popular for a reason. I give them credit. I knew it would be difficult to impress an Italian with New York City pizza. You are a very strict, but I think fair judge. Nothing has jumped out at you yet. Before we get to our final stop, could you tell our American viewers, what is the pizza culture like in Italy? Is there a pizza shop on every corner like in New York City? Well, of course <laughs> it is. And uh, usually we eat pizza. We can eat pizza like uh, two, three times uh, a week. And uh, sometimes it can be a quick bite, a slice like this. But uh, usually the weekends there is always uh, going to restaurants, to pizzeria and uh, have a pizza with family or with friends. We can also prepare it and cook it uh, at home. So yeah, it's uh, the pizza culture is everywhere in Italy. I mean, I think there is no Italian in the world, in Italy, in the world that uh, doesn't like pizza. Okay, well guys, hopefully we have saved the best for last. I'm taking him to my favorite pizza place, my favorite slice in all of New York City, fingers crossed. He's gonna at least like it a little bit. Fingers crossed. He's Let's tough. See. He's Let's tough. See. Anyone who's been watching this channel for any length of time realizes that Bleecker Street Pizza is my favorite pizza in all of New York City. Everyone's got their spot. This is my spot. There's one slice. This guy needs to try. You ready? Hmm. Let's see. He's curious. All right, let's go. Thank you very much. He's from Italy and he's visiting and I'm Johnny. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. This is the owner, Jack. Uh, Johnny, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. John. Nice to meet you. Yeah. John and Johnny? Yeah. yeah. You guys want to do a picture together? We'll put you on the wall? Hello. Sure. Right. Yeah. You recognize me from the videos that I've done here. Going on the wall of fame. Guys, a lot of fanfare in there. They took our picture for the wall. I met somebody that watched the channel. Couldn't get out of there. Hope the pizza's not cold, but the Nana Maria slice, this is what it's all about. Buffalo mozzarella, fresh basil, Parmigiano Reggiano cheese imported from Italy. Let's see what Gianni thinks. I'm really, really thinking that this will be the best one. I'm judging by the look. I can see that there is also, this is a bit, uh, uh, moisture with the uh, olive oil here and uh, it smells good uh, especially the cheese uh, the crust it's uh, crunchy and uh, well cooked and there is also some basil on top which we haven't found it so far so let's try Buonissimo! This is really good. I love the combination of uh, mozzarella. You told me it's a parmesan. I think it is a good parmesan. And uh, the tomato sauce, this is a fresh, fresh tomato. It's just not a, a mash salsa tomatoes. But it's really, really, you can see the pieces of tomato. 
and uh, I love also the taste of basil, the smell of basil. I think it's really, really done very, very well. Mm. It is just all about the fresh ingredients on this, from the basil to the Parmigiano-Reggiano cheese, even the crunchiness of the crust. I mean, it's my favorite slice in New York City for a reason, and I stand by that. If this is the standard New York City pizza, well done, well done. I actually even don't mind that it's very thin because all three ingredients, they just match so well. I think those guys here, they know what they do. Buonissimo! We just started the channel called Gianni and Ivana so if you want to follow us uh, here on YouTube, uh, we will really appreciate. It was so fun for me to take somebody from the country that originated pizza and to see the New York version of it. So it was a really cool experience. Guys, thank you so much for watching as always. Make sure to check out our other New York City playlists, all linked down below. Until next time. We are visiting uh, Italy for the first time. You're visiting the Italy. <laughs> <laughs> oh.